And if I play this, everything's looking pretty good, nice and consistent motion. Our viewport looks good. Man, it's just too bad that we can't use this as an animation uh, just so to see you know, how it's going to look uh, in real life. Oh, I have fooled you because you can do that. All right, so let me show you how. So we wait for the autosave to finish. And then we come over here and we just say, uh, we don't click on that button though. We come over here to tools and we go preview, grab viewport, uh, create preview animation. And we have this window with all these options. Uh, basically what we want is make sure our frame rate is the same as our scene, which it is. Uh, the output right now we're at 1080p, so half of 1080p is uh, 960 by 540 and do we want to be in realistic mode uh, the you know the better things look the slower the preview is going to take so let's let's just take these settings and see um, see how long this takes of course you can change the um, output to be a file sequence if you like and you have just uh, comp or uh, compile that back together uh, inside of uh, another program or we just use the standard AVI uh, at a decent quality. So, I don't know, 75 is good. Okay, so uh, let's go ahead and see what, uh, what we got here. Oh, make sure that it's the right view. It's going to take the view that you have selected, so we're, we're good on that. All right, so you can see here that it's snapping through one frame at a time at about, I don't know, a second, maybe second and a half per frame. Uh, and at this rate, if it took two seconds a frame and we have 480, it's gonna take uh, 960 seconds. Or 400, 480 seconds, I don't know. Anyway, I'll pause it and then we'll, um, we'll We'll pick it up when it's done. All right, so um, we're in the most difficult part of the process is just, it's 95% and we wanna get to 100, but it's going slow. Uh, and it's been a few minutes, I'm not sure how many. I, I feel like it's been uh, a few. So we'll wait for this to finish, and then we'll go through and we'll look at uh, how that animation looks. Because honestly, this doesn't look bad. I mean, it's by no means a finished uh, animation with reflections and, and um, light bounces and all that, but it, it uh, looks good. All right, so when it finishes here, uh, it's going to play our animation for us automatically. And this looks good. The pace is nice and uh, and consistent. All right, I'm seeing some cleanup needs to happen with the cable tray. Uh, but as far as the motion of the camera goes for this shot, I think it's pretty good. So. The thing is with this is that if you were to uh, do another preview right now, it would it would blow out your um, your previous one, and we spent a few minutes waiting for that. So what we want to make sure we do is come down here to uh, grab viewport and save preview animation as. All right, and say what do you want? Well, it's this uh, scene here. And I want to save it as uh, Project Y Camera 001 Preview. All right, so now the next time, which it's doing. So if we come in here and we say uh, Play Preview Animation, it didn't do it. So then what we have to do 
is if we come up here to save preview animation as uh, and we come down here and we see that project Y camera preview it did